Hey guys, today I have a Valentine's Day card to share, and it's my first one of the year. Hopefully, I'll be able to make some more. But this is the first one, and I was happy to be able to finally make one because Valentine's Day cards are my favorite to make. So, here's the one that I made, and I did a lot of watercoloring. So, the whole all the coloring I did was with water coloring. So the background and the girl with the dragonfly is all water colored. And then here is the inside of the card. So I have some of the supplies that I use near me, so I'll share those with you. The girl with the dragonfly is a CC Designs rubber stamp. And she is retired. She was by Sweet November Stamps. And I'll try to look up her name and put it down below. But I just stamped her out with my Heidi Swap Black Archival ink so it wouldn't bleed. And I used her. Then for the paper, I used for this paper, this pink polka dotted paper, and this flower paper here on the, in the background. I used this Pebbles We Go Together paper pad. And I think this is from last year. No, it's from the year before, I guess. But I used that. And for the stickers, I used these. And these, I believe they're from Walmart. I got them last year. And I used a few from there. And I used those here on the inside. So here's the butterfly. And I think I ended up scrapping the other one. So here's the butterfly from there. And I used this, which was also from Walmart from last year. So I'm not sure if they're bringing these out this year again. But I used here the little, I think that's a caterpillar or a centipede. I don't know. But I used him and this butterfly. For these little critters I use, or these bugs, I used um, another sticker pack which I put away. And for all the hearts, so these puffy hearts, I use this sticker sheet which I got at Dollar Tree, I think last year or the year before. And it just has different pattern hearts and I've never seen it again at the Dollar Tree so I'm glad I, I got it when I did. So I used that to make these heart flowers. And then these sticker flowers were from that other sticker pack which I put away. And it's the same thing with the snail. So those were all the stickers I used. The rest are stamps and they're all lawn fawn stamps. So for these little hearts that I stamped out here, I used the lawn fawn Hello Baby. And I just used these tiny little hearts right there. I use the Lawn Fawn Happy Everything, and I use this to stamp out Happy Valentine's Day on the inside. So here that is. Then I used this one, which is one of their smaller stamps, and it's just called Flying By. So I stamped out the Flying By to Say, and I stamped it here on the outside. So that way it says, flying by to say, happy Valentine's Day. So I just did that there and I added three little dots after the sentiment. I used Lawn Fawn Bugs and Kisses, which was their Valentine's Day set from last year. And I just stamped out this little swirly for it flying by. And I stamped it here on the inside. I use the Lawn Fawn Blissful Botanicals. So I told you guys I used a lot of my Lawn Fawn stamps. And for this one, I just used these leaves. And I stamped them in different places just to fill out the background. I also stamped, I think, some of the. No, that was from a different stamp set. So I used this one. This is the Lawn Fawn Friendship. Our Friendship Grows. For this I used the stem and these three leaves up here and that way I made my own 
flower stems and leaves. And finally, I used the Lawn Fawn Flutter By. And this one I used, I think, this leaf only. And I just used that to fill in the background. So there is the card. I did do watercoloring in the background. So I watercolored the whole thing, then I just did little dots all over the background just to give it a little bit more texture. And that is it for my card. So again, here's the front of the card. Here's the inside. And thanks for watching. Bye.